What's up guys, it's CJ from SmartKTai.com and today we're checking out Fast Five for Android. It's a new racing game based on the latest Fast and Furious movie. It brings excellent graphics, fast paced racing and some other neat little twists and gameplay to keep things interesting. Like with all Gameloft games, you can't find it in the Android market, but you can buy it for $4.99 through their online shop. The download link will be in the description down below. And I'll try to cover as many stages and features as possible in this video, so let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so here we are on the main screen. You can see we have Quick Race, which is basically just some uh, quick exhibition races. And then we have Career, as you can see I finished a good portion of that, and then Online Multiplayer. So we're going to go ahead and just jump in Career here, just to get an idea of what you can expect. So we have Chapters here, and there are 10 of them to play through. So let's go ahead and start with chapter one. And as you can see, we have different race modes. So we have elimination. This is basically a knockout mode where you try and uh, run cars off the track. Then we have drift mode. I'm sure you guys know what that is. Uh, time attack. Uh, you just try to race as fast as you can to the end of the level. And then drag racing. That's self-explanatory as well. I'll show you that later on. So let's go ahead and jump into the story mode here. So you can see there's some commentary there, but we'll go ahead and skip through that and jump straight into gameplay. Alright, so a little intro here to the race. She's going to start us off. So this game is accelerometer based, so you just tilt your device uh, to move your vehicle. Uh, but for this video, I am actually using touch controls. so just tap on the left and right side of the screen to move in those directions just wanted to make sure you knew that uh, you could switch those up depending on your preference so as you can see this game does look pretty good and it is quite smooth so I'm starting off with a pretty basic car uh, once you earn some money you can purchase and unlock uh, faster and more durable cars so as you can see there's a button over here I'll go ahead and press that and you'll see that it actually is for oops it's for nitro there we go so let me just speed ahead of all those cars like I'm in third place right now. Now let me show you a neat feature that they've added here. So you can actually take down these cars by ramming them and trying to run them off the road. And as you saw there, it was just a random explosion. You'll see that throughout the game. Uh, there are these exploding events that happen. As you'll see coming up very, very soon, there's one that actually affects the gameplay. So here we go. This construction area is starting to fall apart and you have to go the right way otherwise you'll crash into let's see if we went this way boom we would crash right into it now if you press this button over here you can see it pauses and you can actually rewind and get another opportunity here so I'll go ahead and press play sort of like uh, uh, Prince of Persia if you've ever played that game so you can uh, stop time and choose a different route so pretty cool there uh, you can't do it all the time so it's not like it's a, a cheap move to do uh, you just basically have one or two shots at it so I'll keep going on here now let me show you the takedown boom so you saw I just sort of did the pit maneuver on that car and then he crashed into the side railing and I took him out All right, so here we are in a drag race. So I'll try and explain it as we go. So there we go. And you basically want to shift gears when your light turns green up there. So I'm not doing too well right now. But let's see if we can pull it off here. Now your car is guided automatically. Uh, so you don't have to worry about controlling it, but you can switch lanes by tilting your device. Looks like we're getting close here. 
Can we catch him? Looks like we're in first. And that finish line should be coming up any second now. Oh, and we just hit a car. See, so you would want to switch planes then uh, in order to avoid that car. So I didn't finish first, but you guys get the point. Now, it obviously wouldn't be a Fast and Furious game without a drift mode. So here we are uh, playing this drift mode in Fast 5. So basically, you want to earn points for sliding around the corners. And in order to do that, you apply the brake as so. And you can see we're spinning around. And then once you complete it, you earn those points. So if you run into an object or a wall uh, during the drift, you don't earn points for that. So it says I'm showing off, but I have a I have a feeling that I'm about to crash into the wall. So we'll hit continue. Boom. Yeah, so definitely not showing off there. But you guys get the idea of this drift mode. So now that you have a pretty good idea of how the game plays, uh, let's check out the garage here to see what kind of cars we get. So here we go. You've already seen some of these. This one's called Beast. Dodge Challenger. This car is really fast as you can see by the stats down there. And then this car is pretty good as well. And this is the original car you start out with. It's a nice looking car. An older Charger. Looks like a little race car there. Yep, that is a police car. So those are pretty much the cars you get in this game. Now if you look up here, you can actually upgrade by going into performance and you can upgrade the different levels here. So that'll increase speed and handling. And then you can also change the appearance. So you can come in here, change the color, or you can actually add stuff to the car. So let's jump out of there. Now enough talk, let me just show you some straight up gameplay of some of the stages you haven't seen yet. So that about does it for this video on Fast 5 for Android. It's available for $4.99 from Gameloft's web portal. I'll post a link for that in the description below, so check it out if you're interested. If you happen to enjoy this video, please take a second to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. As usual, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.